Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the member of the Board of Management of Sparkman Brand for Technical Development, Dr. Heinz Jakob Neusser. Thank you, Volkmar. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Please let me introduce two key members, two colleagues of the R&D department. They will assist me as I tell you more about this car. Please take a seat in the car, guys. Thank you. The CES, the CES is a compass that points us to the future, the ideas, technologies, the products born here set the trends for tomorrow. They shape the future. They must be aware of what will drive the world of tomorrow. Therefore, we are concentrating on improved information transfer from car to driver and vice versa. We want to make it more intuitive and easier to operate by transferring the attributes from the consumer electronic world into the cars of tomorrow. Now, other automobile manufacturer invests more in R&D than the Volkswagen Group, and with great success, we think. The E-Golf hit showrooms in the US last year and the high-performance Golf R will follow in several weeks. The Golf R you see here today is a very special vehicle. We have named it the Golf R Touch. From the outside it looks like a conventional Golf R, but inside it offers a preview of Volkswagen's future interior technologies. It's a car whose operation information offerings and ergonomic features are closely aligned with our consumers' and customers' needs. The Golf R Touch is also equipped with a gesture control system. Gesture control marks a further step in the pursuit of our goal to create highly intuitive and easy to operate infotainment systems. We took our lead from the consumer electronics interfaces and use it in smartphones and tablets and redefine it for automotive applications. We've been very systematic in our approach here. That's why the Golf R Touch doesn't have just one display, but rather three. First, the car is equipped with an impressive 12.8 inch main screen in the center console offering brilliant resolution. Beneath the main screen, there is an 8 inch control center screen. And finally, there is a 12.3 inch active info display, which replaces the traditional instrument cluster. The content for the two large screens can be customized in accordance with the user's wishes. As is the case for consumer electronics, images or illustrations can be integrated as a screen background. Various windows can be arranged as tiles containing different content. Another step we took was the replace of all the mechanical buttons and rotary switches normally found in the car. All of this follows our philosophy, make it easy. The use of proximity censoring in every touch panel is an example of this. Another new feature is the multi-touch slider. This new type of control element links functions such as volume control, balance, fader and lightning in the simplest possible manner. The setup here is extremely easy because the slider can recognize the number of fingers being used for adjustment anything from volume to ambient lightning. The ambient light in the Golf R Touch is also quite sophisticated. The example, for example, the lightning atmosphere selected by the user is transferred throughout the entire interior, creating the ultimate customized environment. To ensure drivers are not distracted, Volkswagen has incorporated haptic feedback within the control center screen. As adjustments are made, the system provides sensory feedback, so the driver doesn't have to look away from the road to confirm that the selection was received. This brings me to another important technology that we will be using in the future, the gesture control. All of the functions I talked about before 
can also be carried out in this special golf using gesture control. At the heart of the system is a 3D camera mounted in the roof console. The camera defects and recognizes hand gestures and converts them into commands. This is a highly complex technical setup, but one that's very easy to use. The system significantly increases user convenience. With a swipe of your hand, all functions can be controlled. Thank you for your help, gentlemen. It was excellent to assist me. Thank you. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, simple operation of complex technologies. This is our philosophy. Volkswagen sets this pace for the automotive industry. This involves more than just smartphone, smartwatch, or tablet compatibility. It's about creating highly connected, safe, intelligent vehicles. This is just the beginning. Stay tuned for more to come from Volkswagen. Thank you very much. So, thank you, Dr. Neuser. Thank you, Mr. Tannenberger. Thank you for providing us so much information of these exciting things to come. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for visiting us, for your interest and attention. We will be showing everything you have seen today, all of this and much more tomorrow at the show. So please come to our booth. We are happy to inform you, we are happy to talk to you. And now it's up to me to invite you. Come on the stage, take a look at the car, get in touch with our specialist and thank you again very much for coming here and enjoy the show. Thank you.